Hey, how you guys doing? Um, I wanted to do a video um, about uh, something I lear learned in um, counseling. Um, it was a book that I noticed in counseling. Uh, probably not by accident that I noticed it uh, because it is something that I'm trying to do right now. Um, and the term is called um, ambiguous loss. And it means you're living as if uh, people are dead when they're still moving around and not dead. You know what I mean? Uh, if that makes sense. You, you didn't get any closure, so you, you have to live as if they're dead, you know? Um, and that's, it's not easy. Um, it's not easy at all. And it's something that I'm still trying to achieve is just living my life as if they're all dead, as if they all died in a car accident, you know, um, basically. And it, it, it's hard. Um, even though I had a, uh, actual funeral for them all, it's still hard, you know? So, um, and I, you know, I'm, I'm starting to take this road a little more serious, um, than before, than before. So, um, I'm really trying to live as if they're all, they're all dead. You know, it's not easy. It's not easy thing to do. Um. Because you were you were around them so much, you you know your brain thinks they were real people when you're around them. So um, it's kind of a tough thing for your mind to grasp that they were not real people the whole time. You know, even though you know it, you have the knowledge. It's still hard for your mind to grasp that. You know, <laughs> if that makes any sense. But. Anyways, um, I've been I've been reading this book again, uh, the family family scapegoat, a hidden epidemic. You know, it's it's a good book to read if you were scape scapegoated your whole life. Um, it's a good book to read, um, for sure, for sure. Um, but anyways, that's just that's just something that I, I want to make a make a make a video on was the ambiguous loss because it's not easy to do uh live as if your family died in a car accident you know is not easy to do but yet you have to do it <laughs> or i have to do it you know to move on you know so to to move on mentally because mentally i haven't completely moved on mentally even though physically I'm away like mentally I haven't mentally moved on and I need to mentally move on from it all you know the whole the whole network of family I have to mentally be free of them free of that shit that nonsense you know um, so I can get some peace and sanity in my life for once you know so, anyways, that's all I wanted to say is, uh, it's not easy to live as if everybody you were around are all dead now. You know, it's not easy. Even though they were not real people, they were acting, you know, it's still hard, you know. It's still really hard for the mind to detach, you know. So, anyways, I, I feel for anybody that's uh, had to do that you know, so, and, uh, move on in life, so, because it's not easy, so, anyways, that's all I wanted to say for this video.